What's up, YouTube? It's Easy Top Water Fishing here today, and today I'm going to show you my top 15 baits for summer bass fishing. Uh, these baits um, can help you. Uh, I, I have a link in the description on how to use these baits. I'm not going to be explaining that, but I'll give you a little summary on how the baits work. So the Bomber Fat, fat Free Bait Shad Jr. is the first bait that I would recommend. Um, link to buy that is in the description for every single one. Um, those That one is where you, it's like a little minnow, and you got to kind of flick it up, and it's a deep diver down in the bottom. It's, um, pretty sure it's a crankbait, just moving it like that with your pole. Second one is Cinco Worm. These are really popular worms with a jig head. Uh, those ones, all you have to do is just let it sit there, and then you'll get something. Um, Zara Spook Jr. That one is um, a crankbait. It's really good. It's, it's a but no, yeah, crankbait. It's another same thing as the Bomber Fat Free Shad Jr. It's a really good bait to use. Um, Live Target Hollow Belly Frog. That one's really good for summer pond fishing. If you really think uh, you you'd go summer pond pit, pond pond fishing, you'd use the live target hollow beetle frog. You can use whatever frog you want, but I recommend I recommend hollow belly. And then five. This one's more for uh, on the edge of the pads, not really for ponds. This is for this is buzz bait. It's basically. Either way, you could get a northern or a bass with this. But I caught a bass yesterday with the buzz bait uh, two days ago, but I didn't get any footage on it. So, and then uh, six is the red devil. And again, you can catch that with northern or bass. My brother caught one yesterday. Caught a red devil. Caught a bass on a red devil. It was a five pounder. It's pretty good. And seven is yum paul swim bait summer gill this one is really good it's a swim bait it's like a pull-up jig it works really good if you want to catch a bass in a more of a water flowing area that can move pretty fast uh eight is the strike king uh rage bug that one is really good for uh the deep waters near the rocks where they hang out that's a really good one uh, 9 is the Rapala Husky Jerk 08. Uh, it's a 3.125 inch yellow perch. Basically for more rivers than anything. So more fast moving water than uh, that. So like a dam if you're there somewhere like a dam. Uh, let's see. Uh, 10 is the Rapala x rap Jerk Bait. 10. That one is really good for ponds as well. That one is more of a middle pond. Sometimes you can work cast into the lilies and reel your way back out. That's how you work uh, that thing or the edge of a lily pad line, the edge of the lily pads. <clears throat> 11, Brave Fisherman Minnow Crankbaits. That's more for a big body of water. Or if you're trying to fish like a lake, that's more of uh, for deeper, seven foot, ten foot deep water where they hang out by the rocks. Um, twelve, Rapala Rattlin' 05. That one I've used it. It's really good. That's where I caught my record bass, ten pounder. Um, the Rapala Rattlin' 05. It's really good. Really good uh, thing for lakes, especially and pads. You can really do anything with the Opala Rat Lano 5. Uh, 13 Storm Wild Eye Swim Shad 03. Uh, that one is more morning type of one. I've used all these lures by the way. The Storm Wild Eye one is more of a morning type lure because I, I get really good hits when I'm in the morning fishing. 14, Savage Gear Real Trout Smooth Swim Bait. That's more for a river. If you wanted to get something like a creek, 
river type thing because they're in fast moving water. Uh, 15, last one. Yamamoto 910 20, 9 10 297 Senko 5 inch 10 pack green pumpkin. That, I saved that one the best for last. Yamamoto Senko. I had that up here. Um, the Senko worm. That's the exact same thing. You can just put it on a hook basically if you really want to. Those are the hot baits. Um, I'll leave that in the description for those. All these baits are going to be in the description. Amazing baits. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. There will be another video uploading today. It's a vlog from yesterday. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.